Generalsekretär Ban Ki-moon. Secretary General, precisely because I think your heart is breaking every day as well when you look towards Syria, I'd like you and the, I'd like to congratulate you and the United Nations on at least one thing that has been achieved. As the, you can say that about the Paris Agreement and now the ratification process of it, and I'm absolutely convinced that this agreement is significant for international climate protection, but it's also significant for the United Nations, which you will still be leading until the end of this year. So I hope that you will still be able to achieve something despite the heartbreaking events in Syria. Now, we Greens in the European Parliament expect from Mrs. Royal that the Council should now not only be able to make a decision in the ratification process, but be able to negotiate ambitiously. The European Union has all the technologies available to it. We can create energy in other ways. We can transport energy, but we need once and for all to take the leap forward. We cannot any longer hesitate. The consequences that are being demonstrated today now need to be fed into the negotiations at the top of the European Union. What we achieve in the, what we produce in the indus industrial countries of the world is decisive for the world outside the European Union, not just today, but tomorrow and the day after tomorrow. The climate agreement is a major challenge and we Europeans uh, have a, a need and a desire for ambitious solutions.